people, individuals, families, societies who are thankless and who are ungrateful may be cursed by Allah. Then individuals, people, families, societies who are not content with a single dish, they behave like the maghdub. We need to analyze. We need to make self-analysis and we need to do self-audit. Where do we stand? What are we doing? What are our priorities? Are we content with the single dish? Our family and meal timings? Our parties and get-togethers? Our marriage celebrations? Our iftar meals in Ramadan? Do we limit ourselves to one dish? Simplicity of meals? What, what variety of food on our meals? What craze of multiple dishes in our functions? What obsession? What obsession of courses of lavish dishes for showing off, for exhibition and demonstration of our wealth? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has ordered, Kulu washrubu wa la tusrufu innahu la yuhibbul musrifeen. Eat and drink, but do not be wasteful. Because there's absolutely no doubt that Allah does not love those who are wasteful. Allahumma ja'alli min al-tawwabina wa ja'alli min al-mutatakhireen. Rabbi ghfir wa arham wa anta khayru rahimeen. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help us adopt simplicity in our lives. Help us adopt, help us adopt simple manners in all spheres of life.